springtime in Missouri. Here's all these little plums here. All got their blossoms out. The good healthy ones. Billy has been cold trailing up. A rabbit. Boogie just, I think Boogie just jumped it. Boogie just jumped it. Came out of the most strip and ran down the most strip. Oh, he made a cut right there. up this morning it's first rabbit I got on the other side of where the dogs cut in the rabbit cut down into the tree line here went down the hill and they're making their loop back to where they jumped it up at so I may get a shot of it coming down this bow strip here coming back around on another circle that's the plan anyway There it goes, right across the most strip. Heading down. Looks like it's gonna stop right in there. There it goes, it's still moving. Oh, he cut back. He's cutting back this way. Here he comes. Look at him. He's in that tuft of prairie grass right there. There comes the dogs. They may have came down this way. He got it. place I saw was right there. Oh, Annie, Annie just jumped it. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. There it goes. Get it, Annie. She didn't, she didn't see it long enough. She knows it's out there. Look at her. She's going back. Come on, Boogie. Billy's slowing her down. She should have put her nose down. Yeah, that rabbit cut back up and went back around. They'll pick it. Look at her. She's going to take them right up there to the track. Look at that. Get it, Annie. Get it. Put your nose down. There you go. Put your nose down. Put your nose down. There you go. You'll pick it up. There it is right there. That was pretty nice. Smart rabbit. He brought him down here and backtracked his track. Sweet. He lost him. He lost him on that one. Let me just bring the derby, my derby back up here to the track.
just watered my dogs here. They lost that first rabbit. Oh, they ran it for about 35 minutes. Now we're out here looking for another one. So. Well, I'm thinking they're working this up. Down there where Billy was. There we go. This is the start of our second race, I almost bet. Sounds like it. I just saw my rabbit wiggling down between those cedar trees. There he goes. He's heading down that way. The dogs will be coming through the cedar trees there. There they come. And he made a left right around that cedar tree there. Or right, I guess. My left. Ooh. This is rabbit number two. Last time the, rat, the rabbit came, he came through those two cedar trees, ran down here and made a cut, and went right down into the bottom there. And I'm bringing it back around for a circle, so we'll see if he comes and does it again. But he's heading up the hill. He just came up this metal here. Here comes the dog. There goes a the rabbit. He's That's the same rabbit. That brown rabbit. I think he cut down here by me. Well, I pulled the dogs off that last rabbit because it looked like it was a uh, stiffening up on them. It wouldn't have been long so I didn't want to have the same situation as last week where they ended up catching another one of my runners. So it's kind of unique. It was a brown rabbit. Nice runner. We'll, we'll hit him next time. He's around still. Well, we're looking for rabbit number three and uh, we're pretty close to the lake. The lake's just over the hill there. Maple Leaf Lake. This is a good little spot here. We'll see how far behind the dogs are. There they are. They went completely down the mow strip and came in that plum patch up there on the hill. And 
they're coming to me. back down down the ravine let's see if they get it this time there. dang it I'm a little puff don't know what to do they're taking it right there go down here Annie get down there Annie In my younger days, I go across that log. Not now. There they go. Annie. Well, Annie blew out of there. That's nice. This, this rabbit went down this ravine. There he is, right there. This is where he wiggled through last time. I want to see how these dogs do this ravine though. Because he just he just snuck down this ravine and went through the timber down in there. Let's see if they what they do if they want to come down this hill here. Come on Charlie. Probably passed, he probably went down right here. Right here is probably where he went down. Right over here. Look at that. He crossed down here somewhere. Because he came up right here. And went over.
I cheated a little bit. They were, they had moved and worked all this, and then they were heading up that direction. So I, I called them over here, and Boogie picked up the track right here. So you know that rabbit might have jumped across here. So this rabbit came through here and went down through the timber here in that little ravine there. That's where he came out of last time when I got the video of him. Well, I really like the way this third rabbit's using these ravines down here. If the rabbit really wanted to get get away from the dogs, he could find a hole in here somewhere. He's been running through here, so but he's running big now. Well, this rabbit gave him a slip. They're over here, and I'm pretty sure he crossed right here. Well, from what it looked like down the hill there, looked like he crossed in here somewhere on this fence section and just tinkered on down. I brought, I brought Billy and Boogie down here to the fence. Well, they, they'll get him. Buckshot and blackjack. Fred. There's the girls. So I was keeping that run going. He gave him the slip up back in there. Another finish to our day's run here at the pond. Come on, Annie. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Still in the 30s, so it's beautiful though. Now here's my pack. 